Let's get this one started here. Round one is underway. And we've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is. And this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. Well, he's got the longer reach, and he certainly showed it there in landing that straight punch. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. He loaded up a lot right there, too. Nice kick. Trying to establish that jab once again. Also, the taller fighter lands a knee yet again. And both guys really throwing with authority. Straight right hand, no good. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Timely defense there, huge block for him. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. And they separate. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Oh, he gets the takedown. Could ill afford that. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent, you gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. What a body kick. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. That kick blocked by the Korean Super Bowl. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Beautiful strike. Missed with that right hand. Nicely done to the body. Can't take many of those, you better check. And he landed the right hand there. Well, you saw us reference it in the tail of the tape, DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that check. Nicely done defensively to avoid the double leg takedown there. All right, so both fighters now sort of struggling for position here in the clinch. When you find yourself in this situation, what do you do to get out of it? Anytime it's very tough, anytime you're chest to chest and you have nowhere to go, I think to myself, underhook. Whoever's winning the underhook is winning the clinch battle. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Just out of range with the big right hand. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, that straight punch knocked his head in the wrong direction. Really put his opponent on the Big knee lands right through the opponent's midsection. Ooh, looking to set up that head kick. Beautiful punch. Ten seconds now in round one. Oh, and a nice jab by him there, and that's going to give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. 
He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. Oh, nice jab. All right, there's the horn, and what a round it was. DC, take us through the replays. Punch after punch. He landed him at will. He went right at his opponent, got in his face, and showed this is my octagon. We are going to dance to the beat of my two. All right, here we go with our next round, and how about the striking display in that previous round? He found a lot of openings upstairs, and when we sat down with him on Thursday, he said this dude doesn't move his head, and largely that's how it's played. That's exactly how he thought it would be, and it's exactly what he's seeing early in the fight. Opponent's not moving his head, and he's more than happy to connect over and over with those one-two. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab, he may blow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's gotta be confident that it's going to land, and he's gotta really throw his whole entire body into the strike. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. And now he's hurt. That's one of those shots that if you take one of them, if you in the night, that one landed right on the spot. So far, a little bit stunned, holding on to him now, not doing a ton, just looking to recover. Oh, really using his reach advantage there with that land, DC. Oh, tagged him with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike, and he's landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. Straight right, he misses. Wow, actually got the takedown. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Three minutes to go. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Ooh, big shot land. Head off the center line, slips the punch. Oh, Superman punch! Oh, I love the jab. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fight. Well, earlier in the round, he clearly got stunned by his opponent, but he just has not responded well at all. He hasn't responded well. He hasn't gotten himself back going after getting hurt so bad early in the round. The Korean Superboy gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Punch is blocked. Big kick. Oh, that's a nice straight punch there. Through the punch, got to the target. So there it is, taller fighter landing a knee to the body. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. Keep it going. Go finish this fight. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by Shore. Close guard, nice hammer fist. Oh, seamless transition to half guard, though. Unbelievable how quickly he was able to slice that leg through to get to the half guard. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Oh, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think you're going low and you come right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. 
Big kick land. And they separate. We've got Clip with the right hand. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. Man. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Nice punch lands over the top. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. All right, let's check out some of the action, DC. What a display of just sheer punching in that last round. I mean, he looks like a boxer. He looks like a professional boxer out there throwing and stringing those combinations together. He landed those big punches over and over again, and it was this one right here that really did change the tide of the round. All right, here we go with our next round. A lot to be happy about in that previous round. He was attacking the head at will, and until his opponent adjusts, might as well go back to it. There was no negative to him headhunting. Most times the coaches yell, don't headhunt, don't headhunt. I'm yelling headhunt if right, I'm his quarter. Right. Because every time he's thrown, he lands. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that punch. Nice punch lands over the top. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Lands flush with that right hand. He'd be wise to get the his opponent in a lot of trouble now. That was King Velasquez's punch of choice. Every time he has that overhand right, he hurt people bad. And this guy has his opponent hurt very badly again. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. There's the right hand there. Just over three minutes to go. When you're in the clinch, you can pull down on the head and land these beautiful punches to the head. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. Oh, nice punch there by the Korean Super Bowl. Just misses with the jab. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Choi. Right hand punch the switch. Misses with that punch. Liver kick. Just out of range with that right hand. Punch over the top. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. And they separate. There's another power take down there. Back to the feet now. Oh, well done to block that powerful kick to the body. Whiffs on the elbow. Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body. Really strong. Oh! We got him whip his hip into that kick. And they separate. Wow! Oh! He's a trouble. He's a bad. 
like it did stun him a little bit. Beautiful movement, hip work on the ground here, just outstanding with the transition. He is not staying in one place on the ground. That's very important. All right, so you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. Gets up again here, but hurting. Nice leg kick land. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to... Oh! He's out! Wow! Oh, my goodness, what a fight. Yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. Well, what a moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop in this contest at four minutes, 30 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, the Korean Super Bowl, Duho Chong. And there is the man of the moment, and